Panama City officials could be re relocating the Millville Wastewater Treatment Plant. The city is conducting a $1.5 million study to determine if they should repair the existing plant or rebuild a new one. As News 13's Anna Hoffman tells us, city officials say whatever the decision, the actual work on the system won't start anytime soon. Millville business owner Ashley Ping says rainy days cause a number of obstacles for her store. About once a month, whether it rains or not, but more when it rains for sure. Our toilet backs up all over the place and we have to shut it down. She says her neighbors face the same issues. Ping's building is very old, just like Panama City's sewage system. She says constantly having to invest in repairs is a burden. We've had plumbers out quite a few times and it's cost quite a bit of money. Millville's wastewater treatment plant controls one third of the city's sanitary sewer system, including Ping's building. Panama City City Manager Mark McQueen says they are aware of the problem. He hopes this study with the Department of Environmental Protection will help the city find the best way to address the issue. This is an opportunity for us to assess where does that treatment plant need to be? Does it need to stay where it's at and at what cost to reinvest and put it back into full operation or do we move it? And that's what this study is going to reveal. The $1.5 million study will be funded with grant money from the state legislature. McQueen says the old system often gets blocked and creates a ripple effect for the rest of the users. But the desire is to uh, make our community safer and more reliable and dependent with regard to the infrastructure. In Panama City, Anna Hoffman, News 13, Panhandle Strong. City officials hope to get the project or the study started right away. They anticipate that it'll take around a year to complete.